everyone, my name is Mr. Polachuk and I just want to briefly tell you about the Peacock Collegiate Welding Shop. At the welding shop here we have 16 welding stations. Every welding station is equipped with a stick welder, a MIG welder, and an oxy fuel welding station. So every, all the equipment your student needs to complete the course, to go through the curriculum, is all right there available at their booth for them. So they're not waiting around for equipment. Uh, we have some really modern equipment. We also have some uh, plasma cutter. We have a CNC plasma cutter, which has been really cool and a nice addition to our shop where students can go on AutoCAD, they can draw design, we can cut that out using the computer and get, get a really awesome uh, clean cut image that we can use and we've been able to build some really cool projects with that in the last year. Mainly what the course looks like is students are working through different welding assignments. They're learning the skills of you know how, how do we MIG weld, how do we stick weld, how do we oxy fuel weld. Just learning really basic skills. And then once we get to the, the last end of the course, they get to do a project. Projects look like in grade 9 we do a mini project. In grade 10 we build a rocket stove. So they spend time uh, learning welding and fabrication skills on how to put together a rocket stove. How do we make things square? All these different things. And then when they come out, they're done with this uh, rocket stove. But the best part is the skills they actually leave with after that project. In the senior level, we look at some TIG welding. So we do TIG weld, some mild steel, some stainless steel, some aluminum. So we get, get exposure to that, as well as they get to do a personal project to the senior level. So uh, along with their other stuff, stick welding, MIG welding, etc. But they do get to do a personal project where they actually get to build really whatever they want, as long as the student has the resources and they have the skills to complete that project. We've done all kinds of things in the past, ranging from Santa Claus sleigh for Kinsman Club, we've built table legs, we've done trailer repairs, we've had guitars built and moose antlers, so like more artistic projects where we have, you know, you're designing a metal guitar, and then we've had really functional projects, people building dirt bike ramps and all kinds of stuff like that. So there is lots of options, um, depending where your interests are. We also do work with SAS Youth Apprenticeship, so if you're interested in going on to take welding as a career, you can actually collect up to 300 hours if you complete all of our welding courses and complete SAS Youth Apprenticeship. You have 300 hours that go towards your journeyman. Um, so yeah, it's a really cool space here, and, and I hope that you see, I hope that you like it as much as I do, because it's my favorite space here at Peacock. So yeah, thanks for being here.